Well, last week sitting in that corner was a mountain of air conditioner radiators, approximately $5,000 worth. Now I'm cashing them all in, and there's half of the trimmings that I took off the ends. All little bits of copper worth $248 a pound. The only problem is it went down 35 cents since last week per pound, all because the U.S. economy is crashing. That sucks. And with my trusty Milwaukee Sawzall, I chopped off all those steel plates to get those little tubes off to make the, the rads worth more money. So I've got a trailer full of them to take to the scrapyard, plus some more air conditioner bodies. That pile of uh, steel end plates is only worth about 20 bucks. It took two days of back breaking, bending over, and using a Milwaukee Sawzall to cut them all off. But it's worth it. I made a lot of money this week. All loaded up for our final trip on Friday afternoon to the scrapyard for the week. Cool. Oh, the Turbo Aries wagon has no trouble pulling all this stuff. Goodbye, buddy. to London. Now we're at London Salvage. They pay the most for steel, like those air conditioner bodies, and the most for copper, like all those little tubes I'm bringing in. Mountains of junk. Price is dropping. Yesterday copper was 248 a pound, now it's 240, and yesterday the steel was 115 a ton and now it's only 80. So from that load I got 364 bucks. Copper pipes, little tubes, and those air conditioner bodies. Now we're at Zubix. We're going to get more money for my radiators. Not too bad. They got a nice rust free Volvo we could have farmed that's going to Zubix. I can't believe how much the price is falling. The aluminum is way down. Well, anyways, 350 bucks from Zubix. And gas is $1.10 today. 0.9. Well, now that I'm done my first stage of scrapping air conditioners, which was three weeks of hard work, I decided to add up how much money I made. Hmm, about 320 old air conditioners, three weeks of hard work, lost six or seven pounds of weight, I feel better, I look better. So, let's see. Hmm, this one's mostly copper, $713, uh, that's some copper and some steel, ooh there's a big one, copper aluminum air conditioner radiators, 1230 pounds, at $1.40 a pound, $1722, and just a few days ago it was $1.48 a pound, and it was a lot more than that a couple months ago. Some more radiators. $350. Oh, there's a big one. $1,820. Copper aluminum rads. 
$94.30. White goods, that just means air conditioner bodies. 1,640 pounds. Well, the list goes on and on and on. It all adds up. So now you see why I haven't been on YouTube that much doing this and I'm doing it as quick as possible because of the stupid American economy and their faltering banks are causing commodity prices to crash too. I would have made $3,500 more if the prices were as high as they were in July and I also lost $600 because in just one week but how much everything dropped with the crash we had last week. That sucks. But there is some more good news. Well the good news is that's my birthday and that's the present that Google and YouTube sent me for my birthday. My next check I got for another month of forcing you guys to watch all those commercials on my videos. Boy, I gotta love it. Thank you everyone. That's the coolest thing ever. You guys really do like those commercials, so that's keeping me in the beer money. Well, someday I might not ever have to work again. So, keep watching my videos. Soon I'll have time to make more and edit more and keep enjoying those commercials. Gotta love it. So, now I just got done adding up all those receipts for the money I made from scrap metal and I made $7,291. Awesome.